explanation with me for advanced construction occupation subject for civil engineering department so let's see first of all for excavation equipment we have power shop what is the use of power shop to excavate earth and load into the tractor or a truck mainly this power shell size depend upon the size of the pot okay here we can see the basic parts and operation of the power shell there is a bucket there you can see a boom here is the control beam cabin uh, with the cables connected to the bucket and booms crawler mounted type of power shell is here type of power shell there are only two type of power shell available in the market crawler mounted or else we can say wheel mounted crawler mounted means the wheel of the power shell is crawler here you can see the belt moving around the wheel there is the belt of iron Steel, which which are in multiple rolling tanks, and there can be a wheel mounted also. Wheel mounted means a tire, we are basically um, based on tire pressure. This wheel mounted can be classified. Now here you can see the output of power shell. Mainly there are classification according to class, class of material. Different class of material. We get different output of power shell. Height of cut, angle of spin, operating skill, milling information, job condition, size of problem unit, physical condition, all exchange clean up of the room area so basically power shell is a multitasking excavation equipment now we can go for drag line here in the picture you can see the drag line it has a large boom with bucket and this bucket can be up to a large depth, larger than our shell. This is the picture of your drag line. Drag line means just a boom, bucket, cable, cabin, and it is also a crawler mounted type drag line. So what are the factors of taking output of drag line? Mainly, mainly main type is type of bucket, length of boom, it may varies as per the requirement, type of material, angle of spin, depth of cut, you can see here it can go to 3.1 meter cube it can cut working condition large open space it can work up to large area than power shaft so it is more advantage for work and its efficiency is high 
5 to 4 the type of drag line mainly it is classified based on problem in the movement and other is top mode here you can see crawler now speed is low and soft ground it can work and we move high speed paved ground and top now high speed paved ground and we move into black hole black house is similar to Pasha you can say group Pasha it is turned as back on full power full shell it is a class of power shell you can see the difference figure of power shell this is a wheel mounted Now here are, we are discussing factor affecting force. Then the output is about same as that of power shell. We have seen that it is a group of power shell. So the output will be also similar to power shell. That, in, that is increased output of more will decrease. Greater output is obtained when degree is done. Another machine with more, more stability. If it is near to the south, it will be compatible. Selection of oh. maximum excavation depth required, maximum working radius required for digging and dumping, maximum dump space height required. Hosting capacity required. These are the selection type of hole. Now we will be moving to cancer. Here you can see the figure of cancer. It is, though it is mainly named after a bucket called shell. So it is also inseparable. Shellfish with hinge, there is a hinge of double shell, there is a hinge at the point where this bucket can rotate towards and away. There are two buckets in opposite direction. Here you can see the color of bucket. Selection of bucket depends on the government option. There are light buckets, medium buckets, heavy buckets. So, mainly we have we have uh, this bucket for different purpose. If it is use a cancer, you should be you should be placed on level ground. Here we have to place the equipment in the level ground bucket tree should be sharp here you can see the buckets teeth are sharp so that it can go to large depth and dig easily and dig and dump easily now we are going to trenching machine trenching machine are also called as excavation equipment. These are generally uh, used for sewer lines, water lines, gas lines. Mainly it is used for this type of works. Telephone lines, drainage lines, etc. Here is the figure of trenching machine. It is a wheel type trenching machine. Here it can rotate and excavate the ground in a row with 
next position neutral on either side wheel type trenching machine this can cut up to a width of 30 to 150 cm and a depth of up to 3 meters and the speed is 30 meters or more in any job so these are the different characteristics of tension machine this is a ladder type tension machine and you can see the large beam this ladder type tension machine with this 360 meter which is larger than wheel type you can get up to 10 meters okay. Here we can see vertical boom type crunching machine. You can this vertical boom crunching machine can go vertical or else horizontal also. So it has maximum advantage than the other two. This machine is a modification of lever type machine. This is it is available in seven different boom size with which allow quench width from 40 to 70 cm okay. thank you guys best wishes god bless you stay tuned with us thank you